I'm here in the Roosevelt Park neighborhood near downtown where neighbors say in the last few days they've already seen professional grade fireworks going off and they're worried those fireworks could hit their homes and cause fires. Big fireworks going off in San Jose. A surveillance camera caught one of the illegal fireworks shows on Friday near East Santa Clara Street downtown. These are uh, basically the old fashioned professional grade fireworks and which are quite dangerous. So dangerous that Roosevelt Park Neighborhood Association President Jeff Levine says he's afraid to leave his home on the 4th of July for fear of returning to a fire. I'm a prisoner here because I have to watch my house in the immediate neighborhood because we've had uh, trees set on fire. Now the San Jose Fire Department is encouraging people to report illegal fireworks on the city's 311 app. We are using the data from the San Jose 311 site to create hotspot maps. The city also has a social host ordinance enabling property owners to be fined if they allow fireworks on their site. And that's not all. You can be cited just for watching an illegal fireworks show. It also includes a provision where becoming a spectator, a knowing spectator of an illegal fireworks show is against the law and can be fined. San Mateo County is trying a different approach. Over the weekend, the Sheriff's Department collected nearly 400 pounds of fireworks during a new buyback program, trading cash for fireworks of any kind. No questions asked. If you want to see fireworks on 4th of July, the fire department recommends you see one of two free shows in San Jose, one at Almaden Lake Park and the other at Discovery Meadow. In San Jose, Marianne Favreau, NBC Bay Area News. Okay.